This tutorial is going to show you how to move files that are stored on the local board. Anytime that you do a recording of an EasyWrite session, it's automatically saved to the local storage of the interactive flat panel you're on. You don't want to keep it there because that's very limited storage and it gets wiped by the district on an occasional basis. So you want to move it right away. So I just got done making a tutorial and I need to move that tutorial to my Google Drive. So you're going to go into this AMS files, which if you don't have it, you can get it from the apps page using your app launcher. And you will see everything is saved for you in your local drive when you're logged in. So if you notice here, the local device, my folder, I've got my file, which is saved automatically by date and timestamp as an MP4. So the recording of the easy write session that I just did is right here. So what I want to do first is use my select tool. I'm going to select the file that I want to move that's in my local storage. And then I'm going to hit this move button. And then I'm going to choose where do I want to move it to. And so I've already linked up my Google Drive. So I'm going to go to my Google Drive. I'm going to go to my drive. It will open up my Google Drive. And for right now, I am just going to save it right into here or pick a, a file. So I am going to save it into this one that's this, I've got this BenQ file that's already set. And we're going to click to move it here and I'm gonna hit this paste button. And that will upload that file in there. So when I do that paste, so now my file is right there. If I wanted to, I could rename this so I can hit the select. I can do this, I can rename the file right directly in here if I want to. So this one, uh, I'm using the keyboard here. I'm going to click in. This is my easy right five. There it is. And hit OK, and that will rename the file so that I've got my easy right five file there. So that's a quick way of how you would get your anything that's saved directly to your local to your Google Drive.